Hello folks, my name is Larry Spruce with TX Dash Covers. Hey, let me thank you for watching the video. First off, uh, if we do anything in this video that helps you in any form or fashion, please hit the like and subscribe button. We need all the help we can get. Today we're going to be discussing oh, a question that we have by a lot of viewers out there and a lot of people here on our website and in the office. What is a whale nut? How is it used? And what is it used for? Well, nuts can be used for many different different applications, from boats, uh, motorcycle windshields, industrial applications, or just anywhere where you need to uh, actually affix something and you can't get to the nut on the back side. Well, the next question I get is, what is a well nut? Well, a well nut is a piece of semi-hard rubber that has a threaded brass insert in the bottom of it. Now, each well nut may use an 8, a 10, or whatever the size screw that you're using. So make sure that you get the right well nut for the right application. Uh, also, the length is very important. If it's too short, it will not be effective, will not work 100%. What we're going to do today is the other thing you will need is a the screw that's going to fit in it, of course. And you'll need some type of washer. And I found this old washer came off of a piece of sheet metal. It was on one of our buildings. And it has a rubber gasket on the bottom of it so hey this really works pretty good on here I never thought about it until I found this washer today we're going to be working with a 1024 uh, threaded well nut and the screws are 1024 by one inch what happens is you put the screw in the washer inside the well nut and in, in return it pulls the bottom of this insert this direction and squeezes it out well, let's put it together and see how this actually works out. We've got a piece of 1 8 inch flat bar here. We drill a hole the size that we need. And the hole size is real important. If it's too big, you have a hard time tightening this thing up. So let's uh, always make sure the hole is the proper size for the, the correct well, well nut. As you see, I've got it in place. And you'll come right in here and you'll take a, a screw. Let me get the drill. You can normally use a regular screwdriver. And I'm going to cheat a little bit. I'm going to grab this on the back side. Normally you would grab it on this side where you see this drill bit because you don't have access to the back side. It's normally the reason why you're using a well nut, right? All right, let's hold this thing down and let's snug it up. There we go. Now as you see, we've got her snug down. It's tight on this side and it tightened up on that side. See how it bulged out the bottom? That little brass insert in there pulled up against that metal to where now you cannot get this screw out of there. So that's the basic purpose of a, a well nut. Many different applications, many different uses. Now, I'm going to take this back out and actually going to apply, I'll put another piece of metal. I'm going to leave the well nut in place, push it in. I'm going to take another one of these flat bars and I am going to put it right there, just like that. Now, I got a funny feeling that this well nut is not going to be sufficient for this. Simply because it needs to be a little longer. The brass insert is almost up to the middle now. But it might work good enough just to kind of secure these two pieces. Let's tighten it down and see what happens. There we go. All right, let's bend that way. As you see, it pulled the metal together, but it didn't swell up as far back as the first piece. So, did it work 100%? No. Did it work 80%? Yes. You're not going to be able to pull this apart no matter how hard you try, unless you pound on it and beat it with a hammer. But I personally would actually run with a little bit longer well nut. Well, folks, that's uh, all of it in a nutshell. What a well nut is, what it, how it works, some of the basic uses. And I ask that, uh, you know, if we passed on any information that helped you, please hit the like and subscribe button. Uh, we're not one of these multi-million dollar companies out there that uh, put out thousand dollar videos. This is just an old homegrown video, homegrown video that, hell, I'm putting together right here myself. Just to try to answer a few questions that we get from a lot of our customers at tx-covers.com. We have a lot of different information, a lot of different uh, 
videos, sawmills, all the way down to restaurants, uh, many different types. And we sell a lot of different products at TX Dash Covers. Uh, if you'd like to check us out, visit us online. We normally ship the same day, Monday through Friday. And I hope the video does help a few of you. We'd like to thank you again for watching. Enjoy your day and have a good day.